friends upsc prelims exam is one week away and those students who feel that they are weak in csat exam paper 2 exam and who want to improve their score in this last one week of preparation have to have a different kind of approach for example if exam is some 4 to 5 months away you could have purchased a book and spent 3 days on time and work 3 days on time and distance some 5 days on algebra means you can spend some time on each topic but now exam is only one week away <coughs> at this time purchasing a book learning the theorems formula shortcuts is not possible but what can you do see first of all identify what is your weak area is it the english reading comprehensions or is it the aptitude arithmetic and reasoning identify that for example if you feel that your weak area is arithmetic and reasoning because several students failed in the paper 2 in the last 3 to 4 years though they are very good in paper 1 in paper 2 they could not even qualify that is why I am explaining about what you have to do in the last one week. So, if you are weak in arithmetic and reasoning parts what you have to do is collect some 30 question papers it can be last 7 to 8 years of UPSC papers some 7 papers of certain institutes test series papers mock paper some 2 to 3 institutes. So, UPSC papers and some 3 to 4 institutes question papers overall make some 30 question papers. Now, do not try to solve these question papers like exam format, do not try to solve the entire paper in 2 hours, do not do that. Rather what you have to do is collect only those arithmetic and reasoning and logical questions, they will come to around in each paper around 35 questions will be there. So, 35 into 30 into almost 30, so 900 questions will be there. These 900 questions you try to solve some you know uh, 100 to 120 questions per day, not like an exam do not try to have the time pressure while solving these 900 questions. Just take some hard questions, keep solving them, take your own time, think properly, solve those questions and try to have one mentor for this one week. Mentor can be any student or teacher or whoever who has fair good knowledge in arithmetic and reasoning. They no need to be actual UPSC aspirant, the particular student can be an aspirant of banking, staff session commission or any other exam where he is strong in these areas arithmetic and reasoning. So, as you solve 100 questions after 30 40 questions approach the person show how you solved he can come up with some shortcuts or better methods try to learn from him in that way you keep that mentor with you for next 4 5 days continuously and solve the, all these questions. This will not only improve your confidence it will make you run through all possible models of arithmetic and reasoning it will definitely help you in improving your arithmetic and reasoning score in the paper 2 CSAT examination. Also friends those students who feel that they are weak in English reading comprehension I means some, some students feel that they are ok in arithmetic and reasoning, but they are weak in English reading comprehension. Such students what you have to do is almost similar method, but here no need to go through only UPSC papers you can take some of the CAT CAT papers actually CAT paper comprehensions are slightly difficult than UPSC, but UPSC's reading comprehension pa passages the difficulty level is actually increasing year by year. Before 3 years they were like very easy like normal bank examination, but now they are becoming complex that is why I am asking you to take previous years CAT papers CAT CAT the entrance into IAMs MBA. So, take those papers some 5 6 papers take some 4 5 papers of something else GRE, MAT some other examination and take previous years UPSC CSAT papers, but take only last 3 years because till 2017 the reading comprehension level was very easy. So, there is no point of going through those things at this point of time last 3 4 years of UPSC papers and other examination comprehensions take them collect them and again go like passage wise do not try to have any time pressure read the passage carefully quickly and carefully and solve the questions and as you solve them have somebody whom you think is good at solving the passage comprehensions, so that you can be in touch with him, him or her and you can tell them how you solve the questions and they will tell how they would have solved the same question. The reason why I am asking you to have a mentor or somebody a friend is because friends history, economy, polity these things when you write the model exam you no need to have any faculty, you can go through the model answers and understand the, the concept or theorem or theory whatever, but arithmetic, reasoning comprehensions are not like that. By reading the model answers you would not actually understand the best method. 
is better to have somebody who will tell their way of solving the problem the shortcut method or the way they solve reading comprehension the way they decipher the comprehension how comprehension can be read quickly by leaving away unnecessary words uh, focusing on all, all, all important words and finishing the comprehension in less time how to understand the passage questions so these things you cannot learn from the model answers you require somebody so if you have a team of 3 4 people you three four people together can have a mentor and you can solve the same 900 some arithmetic questions and some 60 70 passages and you can interact with the mentor that's the only way you can get the confidence improve your speed and cover all types of models for this cset examination and friends definitely is difficult for you to focus both on arithmetic reasoning and english both if you want to focus it may be slight difficult choose any one focus more on that other things spend less time this is how you can definitely clear csat paper 2 by you know getting more than 67 marks out of 200 and all the best friends do well